psychosis is a way of changing to a new reality. I cease to exist in some way. My energy and that energy goes together, something like merging, and it's intense. I mean, if you're sitting in a roller coaster and you have all this excitement and, and expectations, 10 times, 10 times, 10 times, because I don't know this territory, but at the same time, I know it. So my body takes over and says, you know this. I cannot make sense of it. I cannot describe it with words, what I'm doing. But what my body does, it knows. I am diving into this knowing that, that women know. When I, I give birth to my child, that knowing, just knowing what to do at that moment and where it comes from, it's not my mind who, who makes it up. It's the energy who tells me. And I'm just moving with it. In, in, in certain places, I cannot go there because I'm so overwhelmed. I close off and I get in, in this frozen state, like a kind of panic. And I have to go because it's too much. Um, and now, because this is natural and this is, is clear, so I can open up and it's not overwhelming. But I have to adapt because like the hot flashes, it's huge. My system is like breaking open, like you have, you, you go into a, a sauna and it's, it's too hot at, this, at that moment. And so I have to adapt to that, but I, I, I'm used to this now after a week. It's, it's rough nature. I can sense it. It's nurturing for me. It's like, like it's, it's taking me with, with them. And, and yeah. It's forging you into a diamond. Almost. Wow. You're still thinking like hierarchical, but that's not how nature works. It's flat. Huh? Everything in nature has its value. And it's, it's committing to work together. It's an organic system. So one influences the other and is beneficial for both and is beneficial for both. Time is making loops, like in the loop, we are just connecting, that's linear, but that's not how nature works. Nature works with cycles. And that's what I see here. I see all the cycles, and then I see how we are trying, and, and I understand, make one timeline, like from there to there, or from here to there, whatever. But that's not natural, so we are, always struggling with nature. So we're all always bouncing against reality. And that gives frictions, gives frictions. I think psychosis is a way of changing to a new reality. Okay. Because, because I, I feel like, like now I have all these, these colors and, and visuals you could see that as psychosis because I mean, I'm, I have time distortions. I'm not sure what I'm seeing. I have to mm -hmm. orient again because, okay, I'm here. I'm in this time. So it's, it's a state I'm going through. And it's just because I, just my stays. system needs to change. My mostly my nervous system is updating and it's, it's, moving like this i'm going up and it's it's prefrontal because i have a lot of headaches here and my, mm -hmm. my tension in my neck here is is really bad so that's a state but then you're around pure life force which is slightly different than psychosis is it if i get too much life force that's psychosis as i considering it too much life force. Yes. Like these hot flashes, when I would stay in that, yeah, I would get crazy. I would lose every contact with reality. With... It's like staying it's like on the edge. It's like an eruption. 
It's like it's staying like on the edge. It's like an eruption. The direct connection between my core and the core of the Earth is, is stronger. Oh. It's not so... So you're more aligned to the core of the Earth, to the center of the Taurus, to the zero point. Yeah, I'm not. All those other. I'm not like in you're psychosis. Not spinning as much. You're, you're spinning. Yeah. Yes. That's the that's the problem People with psychosis. People don't like the you're spitting for spinning. some reason. Yeah. And you get nauseous about it. Psychosis is a way of changing to a new reality. Psychosis is changing to a new reality.